pick the rifle up, turn it to where that trigger is facing you. Lay that trigger on top of your left shoulder. Your other left, soldier. I have been with uh, C Battery, 3rd U.S. Artillery out of Fort Kearney for 23 years. I have been teaching the Civil War class at the museum for 16. I was reenacting as a blacksmith at uh, Fort Kearney one time, and uh, the, re the Civil War reenactors were there, and just got to talking with them, and they had lost their blacksmith during the winter uh, with heart problems and asked if I would come out and work as their blacksmith and then just work myself up to crew. The Camp of Instruction, which is the Civil War equivalent to um, today's boot camp. Nebraska was involved in the Civil War. Nebraska ranked third of all states or territories providing men to the war. We sent 3,256 soldiers to the Union Army. And uh, uh, just teaching them what the soldiers had to learn in the manual of arms and lining up and everything yeah. else. So it's, uh, just kind of giving them a taste of what it was like. The cannon we have here today is model 1838. 12 pound mountain howitzer. It's on a Model 1 carriage, which has the toolboxes on it. Effective range of that gun was about 800 yards. Um, today we fire with just a blank round, just using four ounces of powder. The kids, the kids enjoy it. They uh, get a new respect for it when it does go off to the, the power that, they, that a gun like that has. I have been uh, reenacting since uh, 1991. I'm still in it at least part of the time and uh, still enjoy coming out and uh, sharing the knowledge that uh, I have I've gained through learning this these aspects of the, of the Civil War and uh, I just uh, like I say enjoy interacting with people, trying to maybe put a little realism and truth into the experience that we have when we, when we share these types of events. There's a lot of misconceptions and a lot of myths. I, I have researched these things quite, uh, quite a bit over the years and uh, I enjoy trying to tell a, portray a true picture of what was really going on. The history of the Civil War is really fascinating. The thing that really interests me a lot is what uh, the soldiers went through the common people, the experiences they've had, <clears throat> and the way we learn about them through their letters and journals and diaries, the stories that were passed on. And that's what I like to share with the kids. Basically what camp life was like, uh, what they went through when they rec were recruited into the Army, what kind of physical examination they went through, uh, <clears throat> the kind of food, equipment, and things that they dealt with, and the experiences that they had while they were serving in the Army both in the big camps and also when they were out on a campaign. We're showing them actual items that they would have had, uh, the kinds of food they've had, uh, sharing with them the artifacts and the items that the Civil War soldiers, the kinds of uniforms, the equipment, and that sort of thing that they don't learn how to ordinarily get in the regular classroom or out of the textbook. <laughs> Good boy!